Welcome. Today we're going to be going over differentiation and integration. We have Chad again from the Glow Blob Gym skit that we did. And today we're going into his work life. He's the front of house manager at his restaurant. And we're going to show how he has to deal with certain employees. He has to deal with servers and food <clears throat> and bussers as well as cooks on the expo line and each one has their own specific task and duties which is differentiation and there's ways that they're involved with each other interdependent now we're going to go over that yo matt i haven't been sat in an hour how incompetent can a host be? Yo, know, Jimmy Bobby, the, the table's a mess. I can't put people there. Well, get a busser. Lord knows I can't clean a table. In this situation, you can see the server is dependent upon the host to bring guests to a table in his section so he can greet them. The host has an issue of not being able to seat guests due to the fact that a busser has yet to clean off the section. You can see the relationship between those three employees. Yo, Samantha, I need to see guests there ASAP. <sighs> Fine, guys. I, my clan is just leave me alone. Here, the busser is finally being told to actually go do their job. The host is trying to get them to do it as fast as possible. With this full example, you can see where the output and input of each job relates to one another. I got two rots that need some extra cheese. Here you can see the server taking an order from one of his tables to the kitchen. The kitchen's finally able to actually perform a task. The output of the server is the input of the kitchen. The kitchen then has to manage and delegate tasks in its own self. Certain representatives in the back of the house are going to be doing certain specific tasks. There might be somebody that fries particular foods, and depending on each order, evaluates who has to do what. Expo and the kitchen manager tend to organize that whole situation. Order up! Enjoy your meal. And that is all we have for differentiation and integration. Thank you.